in this video I'll show you how to customize the home screen of your iPhone. This is the iPhone 16 Pro Max running on iOS 18.3 and you have apps and widgets and you can customize everything here. You can add widgets, you can remove apps, remove widgets and first you have these stacks on top of the screen and you can change these widgets here for example i have the calendar and the photos so this is the there is a stack of widgets on the phone here and i can remove one of them and now there is only one widget in that stack if i remove the last remaining widget in this stack then it's gone the same with the second one on the left i can i can scroll to see multiple widgets if i wanted to and i can edit the widgets also it's useful to have the weather shown on your home screen and also the time, but it's up to you how you want it. You can also customize the size of the widget. So for example, now I have space for two widgets. You can make the widgets larger or smaller, depending on how you prefer. You always long press on on up or a widget or the stack of widgets, and then you can customize the size or you can customize the contents. For example, you can long press on an app and you can choose to remove the app if you wanted to. And they also have this uh, jiggle, jiggle mode where you can remove the apps, uninstall them if you wanted to, or only remove them from the home screen. Here is the calendar app. I could see now there is a calendar events on the home screen and I can remove it. I don't need it to be there. And most of the time you will need to rearrange the icons on your home screen and you can convert an app icon into a widget that's really useful and you can convert it into a full size widget or a square small widget like this when the apps are in jiggle mode you can move them around and also you can move apps on top of each other to create folders on the home screen you can add apps to a folder to an existing folder but if you want to make a new folder you find two apps that you want to group in one folder and you just drag one up on the other. But sometimes they, they are not really working well. If that happens, you can let go of the app you're trying to move and try again. Maybe change the position slightly so they will they will be... It has to be you have to let go of one app in the center of the other app and then it will create a new folder and they you can even give a name to the folder like that. To go into the edit mode, you can long press in an empty area of your home screen. Then you see there on top edit. And now in edit, you can really add new widgets if you wanted to. You can customize the, the whole home screen or even rearrange the pages, the home screen pages. Here I can search for widgets from apps I have on my iPhone. I find the widget I want to add to the home screen and I drag the widget onto the home screen and let go and that's it. Thanks for watching.